Okay guys, these are the two apps that I'm using these days to do gridding. One is called Drawing from References. And, um, okay, let me just take this out. This was already being used. Okay, so here's your home screen. Um, to choose your image, you click your icon down here, and it gives you all different options. Like if you click on, well, this is the app library. If you want your library, look, you have your phone gallery, your Google Drive. This one is really comprehensive in terms of what it, it presents to you, what you want to choose. And then here's your favorites. And here's a girl that I've, uh, I've done in another tutorial. Um, and what I love about this app, okay, if we do a grid, let me take out this first. Um, I'll show you in a second what that is. Okay, automatically it just puts everything into four columns across and uh, five rows going down, maybe like five and a half. Um, and that, that's kind of perfect. And very often I will draw just from the app. I will take whatever um, canvas I'm using, if, I, if it's paper or whatever, and then, you know, just create four columns. And depending on how large it is, I, the, the main thing is I have to just make sure that they're perfect squares, just like they're perfect squares here. Now, very often I just draw directly from the phone, and you can see. Uh, if I need more help, I click on this icon here and customize grid. And it says here, draw diagonals, yes, and apply. And now I have even more information where I can break those boxes down even smaller. And I suggest doing this in my course, except where I do it is, you know, if I have just the blocks without the diagonals printed out, I will I will break them down into uh, additional squares where this is breaking four squares rather whereas this is breaking them down into four triangles right okay so this is one app and the other app I use is where did it go here it is it's called artist grid now what I like about this one or what I, I should let me start out why I don't like it here's your folder and it's only giving you it does it's not giving you as many options of where you can draw your images from um and also too if you want to use like this already is gridded from my other app but just to show you it, what they do they don't have the diagonals feature if you want here's like see you can see their grid if you need more help you just keep touching it and it keeps creating more and more boxes but that doesn't really help you if you have four boxes laid out and then you keep dividing this um it just doesn't because see here's three across now there's like four across three across and then a half on each side it just gets really confusing so i don't I don't use this one for gridding, but what I do use it for is this feature over here. You click this icon and you click edges and look, you get you get the image. Now I this I've already drawn um, brought this in from the other app with the the um, lines, you know, the grid already on it. This is a very large grid as you'll see as we move along in this class. Um, but what I love is just this outline. It's, it's great. It just makes it so much easier. And um, I'm providing this as a printout in the Shadow Girl class. So um, you don't really have to pull up these apps right now, but they're great for you to have in the future. Okay, so let's get started.